Hello everybody, um, it's about 11.30 at night, uh, well, let's just leave the sound on. <sighs> I'm just blown away. Um, first of all, LSU lost, as you, everybody knows. Um, rubbing in our faces, we're not a good team. You know, Georgia fans, Alabama fans, every SEC fan, except for Vanderbilt, is rubbing in our faces right now. Um, especially the big names like Georgia, Alabama, which, you know, really, they don't have no room. Georgia don't really have no room to talk because we beat them, crushed them two years in a row. Well, that's beside the point. Um, good win for Georgia today. They beat Tennessee, um, as expected. Tennessee is trash today, but, um, I don't know if they're, you know, not what happened, but they look like garbage. <laughs> they did. So, hey, LSU did, too. I'm not saying we didn't. We look like more garbage. Um, Tennessee would freaking crush us. Anybody would crush us. I think Vanderbilt would, again. I mean, if we played them again. Anyway, um, LSU lost. Um, didn't play a good game. I'm more disappointed this time. I mean, I'm, well, I don't know. I think I was more disappointed the first time, but I... You know, I'm. Ex you know, after this game, I've learned that di I'm not going to be disappointed from now on because I know what kind of team this is. You know, because I thought maybe they'd be good. Maybe, maybe beat Florida. Probably not though. Um, but now for sure they're not going to beat them. They probably won't win games except for maybe South Carolina. I say I see them going two and eight. It's sad. Arkansas is a freaking good team. Um, Ole Miss is an awesome team. They almost beat Alabama. Alabama won, what's my score, 60, 63 to uh, 48, yeah, 63 to 48, that was an awesome game, I love that game, um, uh, so congratulations to Alabama, well, you know what, don't congratulate them, because, you know, I don't know why, sorry about that, dang it, um, but, I mean, uh, I'm just aggravated, I mean, I'm just blown away, I really didn't have no time to do this video earlier, First of all, it's busy. We had to go get our camper from Hurricane Delta. The water is starting to rise, and we had to go get it before it freaking blew away. But, um, we had to do that, like, at 11 o'clock this morning. And then I just watching the games. I was just doing other stuff, um, so I didn't have time to, uh, make a video. I'm finally doing it now. As I said, the phone life is, like, on 5%, so I don't have long to do this. Um, dang. I'm watching Nick Saban get mad. Didn't think you did. Who does that anymore? Anyway, um, LSU, he, they got to fire Bo Pelini or, you know, Ed Orgeron could lose his job because it's just embarrassment defense. Um, you know, got to do something about the defense because it's just unnecessary. Giving 45 points to freaking Missouri. Are you kidding me? I feel like, the, first of all, I feel like the LSU Ole Miss game will be a bigger perhaps a bigger blowout than the LSU Alabama game, just in my opinion. I don't know. I'm wrong probably. But I just have that feeling it's gonna be a bigger blowout because you know, just the names, Ole Miss, Alabama, you think Ole Miss is not gonna be that good, but they are. And you think Alabama's always good, so you know, you never know. Alabama didn't look that good. You know, just they just looked up on a few plays. Anyway, um I I'm not I'm done talking about them. LSU just I'm just blown away again, which now I'm not going to be, so you don't have to worry about that. From now, it's just go with the flow, just like every year since last year for freaking 10, 10 years. The same crap over and over again. We need to fire Bo Pelini and get a new young defense coordinator or somebody. And a fire C. Vidman. He, yeah, he's got to go for sure. And get a young offense coordinator. Those are the best. But, um... Final score, 45 to 41. LSU's probably out of the top freaking 100. So, don't worry about them getting in the top 25. Whoever they, I don't care whoever they beat. But, um, definitely didn't expect it at the starting of the season. I don't think anybody did. Um, I'm just, it's, it's on 10%, so I got a little bit. Um, so, it's my video, I guess you could say. Um, who else wanted today? Our, Auburn slipped away with one. They got freaking Arkansas got Arkansas got screwed out of that game. There's some cheating going on today for sure. In that Georgia uh, Tennessee game for sure, that was the worst of the day. 
Arkansas Auburn. And you can correct me if I'm wrong, but in my opinion, I, it looked like it was a fumble. Um, a little bit in the Alabama Ole Miss game. Uh, not in LSU, Missouri. That's just, we can't blame on the officiating. If there was any, I didn't even watch the game. But I'm sure there wasn't because I just don't think there was. Anyway, um, basically that's all I have to say for this game. Just can't really talk about nothing. It's, just a, it's the defense. The offense is terrible too, but not, you can't blame it all on them. They put up 41 points. Couldn't quite outscore the defense. So if this was a spring game, defense against all offense, defense won again. Defeated us again. Couldn't outscore them. Hey, that's on LSU. Um, LSU's defense. You got to fire Bo Pelini. You just have to. He, he sucks. He's not good no more. And fire Steve Isminger, too, because this is just this is just stupid now. I mean, it's getting to the point where we deal with it every year. The same offense. The defense changes every year when you get a new coordinator, which, you know, I, I don't know what they're going to do about anything. I'll see how uh, an old round does with this, but uh, we'll see. But uh, I'll see y'all later in the week. Um, Next weekend, we got a bigger weekend. We actually got Georgia, Alabama, um, uh, somebody against Florida. I'm not sure who that team is. Um, somebody, uh, I think we have some other big games. Um, but I think uh, the team that's playing uh, Florida next weekend, I think they uh, they said that they couldn't play because they had a forfeit or something. Um, so I'm not even sure who play, Florida plays next weekend. Um, I don't know, but, uh, I know, uh, LSU plays somebody. I don't think it's Florida. But, uh, hope y'all have a good day. Uh, see how it goes next weekend against the Gators. I was just joking right there. I knew who they were playing. But, um, see how it goes against the Gators. I'm going to watch. I'm not going to go away. I'm going to make the videos. If they go 1-9, and nine, I'm going to make the videos every game as usual. And uh, we might have a guest next weekend for to do our videos. So let's see how this goes. Um, this, this is just this, we've got to do something about our offense and defense coordinators. Just you know, we want change. We got. I think we just looked up last year with everything how it worked out. I think we did. But uh, you know, it's definitely can't wait for the uh, Alabama Georgia game. Uh, next weekend, that's gonna definitely gonna probably be the game of the year. Let's see, it's probably number three versus number two, like uh, LSU and Bama was. Um, where's it at? Alabama? Oh, just, it's working out just like uh, LSU and Alabama last year. I bet Georgia pulls up that. Well, I'm gonna do my prediction Thursday. But um, see how all this stuff goes. I'm off Monday and Tuesday, so I might even do the predictions then. Um. Oh, shut up. Anyway, I'm about to go to bed. I'm just aggravated. I'm blown away again. But uh, I hope y'all have a good day, and I'll see y'all next time.